Okay, we are back on finding the treasure. So let's see where this treasure is that Daniel hid. Okay, not that way. Okay, warmer. What about over here? Ah, is this the hidden clue? Okay, looks like we found the first hidden clue. Ahoy, matey. I found a map of a way. Got it. Now, arr, for the second item, you'll need to find something that eats the sun. Uh huh. Sure. Something that eats the sun. Mm -hmm. You're in the middle zone. Something that eats the sun. What is something that would eat the sun? I'm assuming it means like one of these sculptures. No. As cold as ever. What? You're not giving us many hints right now, Daniel. So why? <laughs> You're in the middle zone. Getting closer. Something that eats the sun. And it's over here. Then what would that be? Okay. Not too far. Oh. Okay, solar panels. Wow, I feel I feel a bit slow. You're in the middle zone. Oh man, you're right there. Just look around. I feel a bit slow. That's a pretty good one. Something that eats the sun up. Solar panels. Um, so we're, we are right here, so we just go do-do-do, right back over there. Found it. Nice. And it's a tracing paper sheet with a red cross. Yeah. Alright, so it's over by those oh, cars. Holy lady. I think I have the whole treasure map. That's a cool ass map you drew, dude. Thanks. Chris told me everything about treasure hunting. Oh, it's fun. Okay, what is it? A watch? Ooh. Looks like something's buried here. What kind of Yes. I think I have found the hidden treasure. <laughs> Um, I'm not a prospector, but it looks like the real deal. Store! You know what time it is. Victory! Dance time! He's gonna get himself hurt up there. Come on, dance! Oh my god. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> you asked for it. Well, at least they are getting along. The Age of Reason. <clears throat> Look at this. What is this? Whoa! I think you're spotting Mom's truck coming back. Mm, yes, one hundred percent. Where do you see that? Gotcha. We'll help her out with the groceries. Is she coming down from that way? Or which way is she coming from? Well, he's able to see everything up there, apparently. Mm 
Um, oh, wow. Okay, she came from the opposite direction. Okay, Dandavillian, here I come. What? <laughs> what is Daniel doing up there? Hello there, you evil flower. I think he's playing a game on the phone or something. Oh, so who's that? Who is that? Is she riding with? Oh, oh I thought she was gonna go in reverse. Gotta empty that truck. This is such a weird fucking place. But that's what's cool about it. Um. Hey. Hey, what's up? What? I don't know why she's honking the horn so hard. Good morning. <laughs> Howdy, Sean. How was the town trip? <laughs> Hate these trips. Uh, people look at us as if we're aliens. Here come the sand people. <laughs> the deserters have returned with offerings from Das Kapital. Jolie! <laughs> oh, wow. I missed you. Next time, you're coming with us. <laughs> we'll see. <laughs> Looking good. What's your secret? Defying death on a daily basis. And hydrating. Oh, right. Can't forget your goodies. Hey, thanks, Angel. Here. Uh, well, at least they all get along yeah, yeah. in this town. Like, they don't, like, you know, Take care. argue or anything so like that. How did you guys also, that was a game? reference to, like, uh, like Star Wars or something. It wasn't it was too cold. amazing. So many stars. So quiet. Good call, Karen. I knew you'd like it. Stargazer. Glad you got to see that. Hi, Mom. How was the town? Town life always sucks. <laughs> but we got something for you. Think fast. Whoa, yes. Thanks, David. <laughs> you uh, want to baseball. play catch, Danny boy? Totally. Oh, no. <laughs> I always used to play, but I'm way better now. Man, he's throwing it, not using his power. No I mean, not using his powers. Through. He just wants to be a kid and play. Yep, Daniel hasn't been like this in forever. You've all been a good influence on him. About time you boys went camping. Hope Daniel didn't get scared by all the critters. <laughs> nah, been a while since Daniel's been afraid of animals or anything. He knows he's the bigger threat. You're right, and he does like to show off. Maybe too much. Yeah, that's very you true. Boys have been here over a month. And I still can't get over Daniel's <sighs> skills. Powers? Um, we can ask him if he's scared. Um, does that kind of scare you? Me? Goddamn right it does. Oh, wow. Never met someone with a superpower before. I try to be a good influence. Not always easy, but he listens to me. Maybe I even fucked him up more. Listen, raising a kid is the toughest job in the world. Trust me. Combat was easier. What was he, uh... What do you mean you're married or how many kids? Like, why would you ask that question when he said, uh... You know, oh, we'll just ask if he's married. You didn't tell me you were married. Nah, I used to be. We're divorced now. Her daughter's death. Left her heartbroken. Same for me. We just couldn't put our pieces back together after what happened. I'm sorry, David. Yeah, the worst thing. Man, is, things are getting a bit soppy. We're just having fun. The right thing for my stepdaughter. Before she died, we were like oil and water, and she was always starting shit. Guess that's hard for a kid to get a new father, especially one like me. I just had no clue how to deal with her. Wish I did. Anyway, I feel like you would have been a good father. Can't go back. <laughs> nope. Thanks for talking, David. Better start my delivery now. Found some weird snacks in town. Arthur's gonna freak. <laughs> Catch you later, Sean. <sighs> okay. Time out. Oh my God. I'm gonna melt. That was awesome, Mom. Now I know why they don't play baseball in the desert. You throw way better than Sean. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> We're calling not a, done calling out us yet. out like that, huh? Let's get this food inside before it melts. No problem. Shh. 
She is so cool. You think? <laughs> Joanne is so cool. Stanley's so cool. The heat is so cool. <laughs> You're way too easy, bro. Whatever. Can't help it if I like Taryn. <laughs> just be you and I know. I'm just saying. Don't get too cozy here. This is a rest stop. I know. Aw. <laughs> We're just walking in like he's float in the bag. Let's see what the shop Ellis said. That's smart that everybody takes turns shopping. Uh, Stanley, one pound of coffee, no decaf, trail mix, mouse trap, and watermelon. R for choco, choco crisps, bacon, soda, and foot powder. So they got a mouse and then some feet problem. She butter, turmeric, ibuprofen, headaches, okay. Very, uh... Very weird list. Um, so are we just gonna leave? Oh, okay, I guess we're gonna just leave the bags there, not put anything actually away. I have to admit, I do miss that Pacific Northwest weather, sometimes. Yeah, I bet. <laughs> You've been here over a month now. What do you think of our little oasis? Um, I mean, I'm not going to say it's too remote or it's another world. It's just a bunch of people building their own <laughs> little very town. Cool and way different. Can't even believe nobody's freaking out about Daniel's power. Well, Sean, it's still hard for me to wrap my head around it. But people here are not going to get in your space. They have their own past, too. That's why people come here from all over the country. For their own reasons. Not perfect, but it works. Yeah, but none of them come back here with, like, superpowers. I'm not gonna say you live as outcasts. No, that'd be stupid. It is so peaceful out here. <laughs> Guess that's Nobody's truly an outcast about. if there's Peace. others like You're them. You're probably right. Yes, I still feel like we're mm. really privileged out here. There's bad shit going on in this desert. <laughs> yeah. I don't think you can ever really get away from everything. You can't escape reality. Even here. We just live slightly apart from it. Why is there always so many negative options to choose? So... How did you end up here? <laughs> this place is not on the map. Like most of us, I was first brought here by someone. Maggie. After I failed to make it in New York, I was lucky enough to meet her down in Florida. Mm. She's had a tough life. This place was her getaway. She's long gone now, but her name is still written all over this place. Well, Maggie, Maggie, Maggie. I don't think we've uh, us here. <clears throat> I don't oh, think we've sure. heard that name yet. I'm glad I was able to help you. By the way, can you grab your evil little bro so we can all talk? Evil? What in the world? Is everything okay? Uh, yeah, I just thought we could spend this day together. Just the three of us. I don't know. Some, something's going on. We might be getting kicked out of this little community here. Big brother to Superwolf? We need you at Karen's trailer. Copy? Sure. I mean, 10-4. <laughs> Well, now it's kind of a uh, kind of bit awkward. Hola, compadre. How about a trek around the canyon today? You in? Totally. Let's pack then. Yeah, I feel like I feel like something suspicious is going on. Like she wouldn't just invite us to like a little trip around. The, like, what if she's trying to take us out? What if she's trying to take Daniel out? Just push him off the cliff? Like what? Especially in the middle of, like, middle of a canyon, like, you wouldn't just bring somebody here. Now it's all dark. I 
should have camped near that little creek. It was so perfect. Nah. You'll need a good night's sleep after all this. And the car's just half a mile down the path. This place makes for a pretty cool bedroom, though. Man. I'm beat. Oh, oh this is sorry. where we came from before. Just one last thing to show you guys. I can't get enough of this place. <sighs> Come on, Daniel. Give me your hand. 